take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. To start, let's break down what a power drop or power sharing feature is. The name is pretty self-explanatory as the phone could now double as a charging pod pad for various accessories for the phone. This includes items like AirPods, another iPhone, or even an Android phone. Pictured is its Qi enabled as well. Let's help you make your mark. Charging my iPhone overnight will overload the battery. False. Once the internal lithium-ion battery hits 100% of its capacity, charging stops. If you leave the smartphone plugged in overnight, it is going to use a bit of energy constantly trickling new juice to the battery every time it falls to 99%. Take our lead. Rumors have long suggested Apple may launch iPhone to iPhone power sharing, with reports claiming iPhones already have the internal components for power drop, but the feature has been disabled by Apple and is being held back by iOS. Take our lead. Apple recommends, as do many others, that you try to keep an iPhone battery between 40 and 80% charged. Topping up to 100% isn't optimal, although it won't necessarily damage your battery, but letting it regularly run down to 0% can prematurely lead to a battery's demise. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.